A new big pump in crypto and stocks is coming. Are you and your family ready for this? Now, yesterday I said in my video, this is due to the second largest central bank in the world cutting interest rates, right? What are we talking about? Not the Federal Reserve, we're talking about China. That's the largest, second largest economy in the world actually just cut even more aggressively than the Federal Reserve. So now, do we think there will be a big pump? It's always been good for crypto and especially Bitcoin, right? The last two bull runs has been caused by China cutting its rates. That's what started the Bitcoin bull run. But which stocks do you think will take off? And what is actually happening to the Chinese economy? Is it actually crashing and collapsing like everyone is saying? I'm actually inside China right now, even though that's not the kind of images they want to show you. Are the tables empty? Is anyone eating or dining out here, right? Do people know what's going on in China right now? Why is it so empty in such a resort, a re luxury resort like this? Or is it because Pablo has hired out this entire place just for himself? What do you think? So at the end of this video, I'm going to give you my list, my personal list of the stocks which I'm investing in or looking into, right? And which stocks in China would benefit from this major pump? Well, they mainly come under two groups, right? One is the internet stocks, you know, like Alibaba or, you know, the, the Baidu, the Google of China. These stocks have been hammered, right, due to both the economy and recent policies by their own government. But the other group is what the government is actually pushing instead of punishing. And these are the new high-tech, high-value manufacturing sector of China. For the web stocks, internet stocks of China, here is K-Web, right? That's actually listed on the NASDAQ, right? It's an ETF of all the China internet stocks. Go and check that out and see if that helps you or not, right? Now, based off this news I was talking about, it basically made a massive jump and looks like the rally is probably only beginning. And then here is a list that represents the new manufacturing, new high-tech stocks of China, right? Such as BYD, you've got SenseTime, the AI stock, right? Ping and insurance, but it has AI te uh, technical abilities as well, right? Right, Meituan, the, the food delivery, right? You've got Billy Billy. These are all, they're actually numbered because these numbers, right? See, 9866 is NEO. That's because that's the code for NEO listed on the Hong Kong Stock Exchange, right? These stocks are all listed on the, like UB Tech, for example, on the Hong Kong Stock Exchange. They're also, some of them are actually listed on the NASDAQ as well. But because of the relationship that China and the US currently has right now, I prefer buying the same stocks on the Hong Kong exchange. And that is obviously because they could get threatened to be delisted one day. But there you get an idea of the so-called high-tech, high-value stocks of China, right? They're the new Magnificent Seven. And if you want me to go into details, right, I could tell you more. 